Hello, people of Earth and the internet. Um, it is the... I don't know what the day is. Um, I think it might be the... Blah, 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 blah. Okay. 17th. The 17th day of recording. And yesterday would have been the 16th day of recording one video a day, a year, for how many years I want to do this. Um, and I would have had a video up if my phone didn't die in the middle of, um, in the middle of uploading it. So that's the reason that I didn't upload it. So instead of uploading it and having it up in the middle of the day, I figured that I would just do two days in one. So this is going to be day 16 and, or, yeah, day 16 and 17, or 17 and 18, whichever one it is, of, um, me recording one video a day. And I promise I'll try to keep it under 10 minutes. Um, so yesterday I woke up, it was a Friday, so today is Saturday, yesterday was Friday, I had school, um, class was okay, I got really frustrated though, because I brought my wrong binder to psychology class, which means that I didn't get to turn on my homework, which I did three days before, and I made sure that I had it all done, and I was like, you know, it was really good quality, and I forgot to turn it in because I had the wrong binder, and usually, but like, okay, well, I'm gonna turn it in later on in the day when I get my binder, and I totally forgot about it the rest of the day, and I realized as I was leaving school that I was like, hmm, I did not turn in my psychology homework. And I'm really depressed about it. I'm like, oh, no, okay. Well, that made me angry. But Friday was good. Um, I came home after Friday. It was. It snowed really, really hard that day. Like really hard. Like chunks like that of snow, like that big, were coming down, and it snowed like five feet. Um, and I got home, and my mom's friend Katie was there, and her son, who's seven years old, um, he was there too. And they were there for about two hours. And my mom, she got her a margarita, which she, like, took one sip of it. She was like, oh, no, 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 that's not okay. So my mom ended up drinking it. Um, oh, and I have these socks. They came in the mail because I ordered them for myself for Christmas. Don't excuse my pantslessness. Um, so at first you think that they're just fish, right? Well, wrong. They have cats on the toes. And I was really excited. Okay. I was really excited about them because I love them so much. So... So yeah, they are really cute and cool. And so that was yesterday. Oh, actually my boyfriend came over and we watched this movie called Enter the Void. And it was really creepy and it was really psychedelic and it was really trippy and I was like, oh wow. And he said that he couldn't continue watching it because he'd have acid flashbacks, which no one likes apparently. <laughs> and he was like, I'm really trying not to trip right now. So we didn't watch the whole thing, which was okay. He kind of like left maybe during the middle of it, which was fine. Um, and then I didn't watch the rest of it because it got really weird. Um, I would suggest watching it though, because it's really it's really cool. Like if you like those different like indie films kind of thing. Um, it's about a drug dealer in Tokyo that gets killed and you can, like his life flashes before his eyes. And the way that it opens up, like it's straight up like POV, like point of view, like, like you are the character and it like usually it will just have straight camera view but like it like blinks and everything so it's really cool um and then besides that and there's like a whole 10 minutes where he like lays back on his bed after he takes like a hit of acid and so um and like he closes his eyes and all you see is like this psychedelic like swirling and like pulsing and it's like Oh, <laughs> um, so yeah, that was yesterday, and this morning I got a phone call at like 11 o'clock in the morning, and it was him, and I had fallen asleep on the couch because I was watching The Master of Disguise, which is an awful movie, but I would suggest watching it anyways because there's this one funny part in it. Um, I got a call from my boyfriend at 11 o'clock in the morning, he goes, hey, are you hungry? And I'm like, I don't know, why? And he was like, oh, well, I have something for you, just, um, just hold on, and I'll be there in like two minutes, and I was like, oh, okay. So I get up and I brush my teeth and I thought they were, they were going to be like special brownies because we had made and eaten special brownies before and I like, I was like, oh wow, these, they were good, like, like just quality grade brownies, like if they were just normal brownies, they'd be fucking delicious, but you couldn't even taste kush, but, um, like the thing was, like, I got really high, so I thought that they were special brownies, so I was like, oh, well, I mean, if he's bringing me brownies, then, I mean, that's totally okay, but, I mean... I don't want my brother eating them <laughs> because my brother eats everything. Well, anyways, but they weren't. They were like donuts. And my favorite thing in the world is like red velvet. And so he hands me like this white bag. Yeah, I still think it's like, you know, it's like brownies. 
And so he was like, here you go. And I was like, what is it? And he's like, you'll find out later. So I'm like, oh, yeah, these are brownies. So then I don't look in the bag because I don't, you know. And so um, and I'm like, oh, you're so sweet. And, you know, he leaves after, like, two seconds, which is fine. And then I open up, and it's, like, red velvet and it's donuts. And he's like, these are for sharing. I'm like, oh. And it's one big red velvet donut with, like, cream cheese in the middle. And then the other, they're, like, donut holes from, like, Bill's Donuts, which is a place that are world famous for donuts. And, like, they have the best donuts. So, I, of course, like, I brushed my teeth earlier, but I ate it immediately. And I couldn't, like, savor the red velvet taste. But it was okay because it was still delicious. And then later on, uh, my brother went to a birthday party for his friend who's turning, like, 14 or something or 15. I don't know. Um... And my mom and I went out to lunch, and we went out to lunch to this place, and it was really good. And so after that, we went to go see a movie, and it was we went and saw Devil's Do, which was really crazy, but it was really good. It was it wasn't like it was scary, like it was scary, but I'm not like scared to go to bed alone tonight, which is good. Um, and then it snowed really hard while we were in the movie theater. Like, we came out, and there was, like, a foot of snow on the ground. And it was really hard to drive back home, but we made it. Uh, before we went, um, we got, like, we went to CVS, and we got, like, shit tons of candy. So I'll show you all the candy that I got. I got Charleston Chews, which is really good. If you haven't had them, then have them. And watermelon sour punch kids. I didn't even eat those. Like, I was so invested in the movie. And then I also got fluffy socks. Mm. They're so soft. Oh my gosh. Like, and they were like $2. And it says, one size fits most. So, and they look pretty small, so they'll probably fit my feet. Because I have really small feet. I wear a size 5.5 in women's, so my feet are really small. So, yeah. That was my day. And so I just got home. It's about, hmm. I'll go check what time it is. Be right back. Don't look my butt. It's 8.22, so it's pretty early in the day. Um, so yeah. And tomorrow, I'm going to go see Paranormal Activity. Um, the Mark, the new one that just came out, with Michael. And then, later on, I'm supposed to go hang out with my other friend, Jared, to watch him get his ears pierced. And starting out in the year, Jared and I were, like, best friends. Like, how I met him was he was sitting at a table by himself. Um, and I had never seen him before, for so he was a freshman. And he was, like, he was kind of, he, like, looked type, like the type of person I'd be friends with. He had, like, the black swishy hair and was, like, wearing, like, white skinny jeans. And he was all by himself at a table. So, I went to him and I was, like, <clears throat> I just touched his face and was, like, shall be your spirit guy he's like what i'm like i'm a junior it's okay and it's like the first day of school it was really funny and then we became best friends and then he started dating my other friend who's like crazy and oh, oh i found a dollar that's cool well anyways yeah he dated my other friend who was kind of crazy and i didn't really approve of it but it was whatever and yeah, and then she, I broke up, and she went away to, like, a mental asylum, and she's still there, which is sad, because I wish she wasn't. These Charleston shoes are, like, chocolate-covered marshmallows. Well, anyways, and we stopped talking after he dated his second girlfriend, Now he's dating his third girlfriend, and I know her. It's not like I don't like her, it's just I don't know her. And she's always seemed, like, apprehensive of me. But whatever. Um, so yeah. That was my day. Um, sorry about not uploading a video tomorrow. No bunny that watches. Um, so yeah, I will, thank you, I will leave, okay. I will leave all my descriptions and things in the space below. And... I thank you for taking this journey with me, and I will see you tomorrow.